Okay, we're back. Second portion. Um, got a GE panel downstairs. 60-60 breaker for the furnace. And down here is a 40 amp for the heat pump. The MOCP is 60 and the MCA is 34.7 on the unit we're doing. So uh, should be okay there. I think we got a breaker swap uh, on the um, electric furnace. So we're right below the portion of the house where the furnace is. Heat pumps just out here outside of the garage. If you're facing the front of the house, all of this is in the left-hand side. The house has two garages. If you get into the area that is not the weight room, that is the incorrect side. Or I'm sorry, if you get into the area that, yeah. If, if you get into the area to where there's no weights and there's an actual furnace, you're in the wrong place. So the proper side of the house for the electric panel and the heat pump is the left-hand side. Um, Pulled the disconnect, took a picture. There's your line set coming in. Um, this is the office. I believe this is the bathroom. So that closet in the furnace is like right in here in the attic. Uh, this is, as far as the property, it's a big property. Um, so, all the way at the end of the drive, the house that we're looking at is the main house on the left-hand side. And furnace, heat pump, and the thermostats are all for the top floor. So we're not doing anything on the bottom floor that has a completely different system. Uh, so, Tony Erbach off of Johnson Road, looking at a day and a half furnace in the attic, heat pump outside, uh, and possibly having to modify the attic access, which I will coordinate repairs if we have to do that. I have a patch guy.